Oh, yeah. That's good. Good, good. I'm not singing this time already. Nah, that was awesome. You knew the lyrics as well. Excellent. So, how's the team's preparation been so far? Yeah, it's been good. Nice to get some sunny weather here too. It's changed, so hopefully that'll stick around. Excellent. So you face a sort of new new midfield combination with Bill Blitz with Nono and Tuliata. How will that does that change your how you approach the game? Or what oh, I'm not saying much. Obviously, there are two very direct runners and, and tough to defend against. You know, Mars. Uh, he, he's got about 20 kilos on me, so it's uh, not an easy night at the office. And uh, you know. Ice plays, he's, he's been outstanding off the bench from on a number of occasions, so he gets a, gets a good opportunity for himself and uh, it's going to be a tough challenge for us. I don't think they've played that much together though, do you see that as perhaps a bit of an advantage? No, oh, they've, they've played footy, they've trained together for a few months on end now, they'll be alright. How hard is it for a midfield combination to sort of jam with people playing a lot of rugby together? I don't think it'd be too bad with Dan Carter inside just so it's uh you know that's gonna help him. Having him back's a big difference for him and uh you know they'll uh, they'll be running lines off him and obviously experience that Mills has at the back there is certainly gonna help him. Is the plan to to be uh, to, to kick for touch rather than kick for position to, to try and uh make use of their line-out inefficiencies of late? We'll play it how we see it, mate. If the space is deep and we can gain field position, we'll try and kick it down there. If we need to put it out in our own half, we'll put it out. I think it's going to change too much. We'll be sticking our own guns. Yeah. Are you sort of being encouraged to kick more, given that the spring have had so much success playing such a high kicking? Yeah, no, I'd like to think we use the ball. I'd like to think the Kiwis will too. I think the fans uh, deserve a good spectacle come Saturday night, weather obviously permitting, and that's going to be a determining factor, I suppose. But I think uh, I think both sides would like to play some footy because realistically we've got nothing to lose. It's the last game for the Nations and it should be an exciting one. How much pressure is there on, on you guys for this match? <laughs> As much as you guys want to make it into me, I don't, it doesn't. It's uh, you know, look, we want to win. It's not life or death though, but we're we're. It's a very exciting challenge for us, and it's something that uh, you know, we'd dearly like to to come out on top of. We haven't done it for a long time here. So. Sort of backing up, you know, back to back wins obviously pretty important to the side. Yeah, for sure, and it's a, it's a good opportunity for a lot of the, uh, you know, including one of the younger guys on the side to. You know, be able to prove obviously the critics wrong, saying that we can't do it and can't back it up. So it's a it's a good challenge for us. How much confidence are you taking in the Brisbane game? Because prior to that, it seemed like a season we were coming pretty close, but getting over the line. Yeah, look, we take a lot of confidence out of that, but really, see, it's one performance, and you know, one I don't know what the saying is, but one thing doesn't make anything. So it doesn't. You've got to you've got to consistently. The All Blacks have done that year on year out. So. Um, and that's why they've been rated the best team in the world for the last sort of five years, obviously until the box have had this standout year. So, you know, they've done it consistently. It's up to us now to try and, to try and do that as well. They've had a few losses this year. Do you think it's perhaps vulnerable to you guys ending that streak over the side of the test? It's a good challenge for us, that's all. <laughs> I am the saying is uh, one swallow does not a summer make. There it is. Yeah. Thanks, Steve. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for you. Yeah, yeah, you, you've done well. Yeah, well, that's about where we're at. You know what yeah. I mean? One win doesn't make anything really. We've got a we've got a back to back performances and, and prove it. Um, not only to obviously everyone out there, but to ourselves as well. Talking birds there. Yeah. Yeah, birds. Hey, we had you on. <laughs> we had you on TV the other night with your with your mum giving you a hairdo. Um, I had a bit of problems just ask for some highlights. Uh, is there anything I can do, like in the short term? Well, actually, Drew Mitchell runs a hairdressing uh, thing in the team here. What's it called? Jackson. Jackson's. That's it. Jackson's hair studio. I haven't actually been there before, but there's been some quite quality cuts out there, mate. So maybe they could get you in the barber chair, perhaps. Fix up those tinges. Yeah. I'd appreciate it. <laughs> Good stuff. Um, can you, well, yeah. uh, can you, you obviously play with him, so can you tell us a bit about him? Yeah, look, exciting talent. Very uh, been outstanding the way he came on last week, directed the side around. He's very calm under pressure for a guy. He's just only turned 21, so. Um, you know, with, along with a number of the other guys like James O'Connor, they've all got good, he good heads on their shoulders. and. Uh, Willie brings a lot to the table in terms of not just his composure, but in terms of his kicking game and running too. He really offers a lot there, so um, we'll hopefully be able to utilise his kicking game Saturday night. And what's he like? Yeah, he's a good guy. Good, good nice, quiet guy, and, and he's got a, he's quietly confident about everything as well. So, which is good. You've got to have a bit of confidence to be able to foot it with the guys at that level. So, 
Um, you know, he'll be excited about getting his first run on over here for sure. I heard he can bench 175. Uh, what about yourself, mate? <laughs> I won't hear that. I'm white. <laughs> We've got nothing. We stick to swimming or something like that, mate. We're hopeless. I can't lift anything. I hear. I hear. Go to number8.co.nz.